Rhodes. Rhodes is our biggest connection to Grahamstown. Our whole family's been through Rhodes. Um, our grandfather, our, our other side of the grandfather, um, other grandfather as well. Um, my my dad, all his brothers, my mom and her sister, and our cousin, and now us. Our grandfather became the vice chancellor here, so he got that that job, and obviously that brought the family here. And then our grandmother worked a lot in the in the township area. She created a lot of schools around there, and so that's how that kind of brought them here. Our, our grandfather was was in College House um, when it when it was yeah. when he was at Rasty, and our dad was in College House as well with with his two brothers. Yeah. And then now obviously Paul and I were, Paul is still in college and I, I was in college. So we've had three, three generations in college house. My grandfather was an extraordinary man. Um, he went to Oxford, Cambridge and Harvard. And he's got, he's, he got his PhD and he's, he's got many, many degrees. Um, he was just an extraordinary man. I don't have any, I don't feel any pressure to live up to him because he's just had such a high standard. You know, I don't feel any pressure towards um, living in his shadow. Um, you know, he was a Rhodes Scholar, his daughter was a Rhodes Scholar. Um, I don't feel that pressure at all because I know that they're just on a complete different level. Um, but it's nice to know that he, that is in our um, tradition, he was that man and we like, were related to him. However, no, don't, I don't feel any pressure living in a shadow. I can't see myself living here when I'm, when I'm working and when I'm older. I, I don't want to live in a big city, however, because obviously just this has this small town life has has um, has affected me so much, and it's made me love it so much. I'm scared of big places, so I'm not going to go live there.